Patel and welcome to the school kids class. So let's start our class and uh, today we will discuss the chapter 8. Okay, so we will discuss a multiple choice question of chapter 8. Okay, and this will help you in your examination. Okay, so let's start. So we have our question number 1 which is the plasmodium will reproduce into. So tell me plasmodium is the example of which reproduction. Yes, it is the example of the asexual reproduction. And which type of the asexual reproduction? Yes, the plasmodium is an example of the multi, sorry, multi cellular reproduction. Okay, multi cellular asexual reproduction. So, what will be the answer? You have option number one two daughter cell. Four daughter cells, only one daughter cell, many daughter cells. So here you can see when it is the example of the multicellular sexual reproduction. So what is the multicellular reproduction? It is the reproduction where the parent cell is divided into many cells. Okay. So the answer will be many daughter cells. Okay. Many daughter cells. Which of this question number two? Which of these example of binary season? Okay. What is the binary season? Binary season is also a sexual reproduction. Sexual reproduction. Okay. And uh, what is the meaning of the season? Just split apart. So when the binary season happens, so what will happen? The parent cell is dividing into parent cell dividing into only two daughter cells okay two daughter cells now what is the example of this you have question number one amoeba lesmania and the plasmodium so you can see the plasmodium will not be the answer because the, we have seen here that plasmodium will reproduce into multicellular okay next we have amoeba and lesmania third we have amoeba and plasmodium so this is also not the answer. Next, we have amoeba and hydra. So, hydra is the example of the budding. Okay. Yes. I think, huh? Yes. Hydra is the example of the budding. But amoeba and leishmania is the example of the binary season. Okay. Yes, we are right that hydra is the example of the budding okay now let's move to another question okay so black fever is caused by black fever is caused by you have option one leishmania hydra amoeba plasmodium so remember i have told you the black fever the kala azar fever okay that is also called the kala azar so it is caused by the leishmania okay remember the sand fly sand fly okay fission asexual reproduction is in so fission asexual reproduction happens in unicellular organisms multicellular organisms none anyone any of them okay so what will be the answer yes the answer will be unicellular organisms okay question number 5 you have Spirogera will reproduce it into two daughter cells. Question number two simply breaks into smaller pieces upon maturation. Option number three regenerate into new one. Option number four sexually reproduce. Okay. So Spirogera will. So tell me Spirogera is the example of which reproduction? So it is the example of asexual reproduction. Okay. And in the asexual reproduction, it is the example of the fragmentation. So what is the fragmentation? It is the process. It is the reproduction where on the maturation stage, stage the body uh, div uh, divided into small pieces. Okay. And 
then after that pieces will grow into a full fledged organs okay so the answer will be here see reproduce into two daughter cell this will not be the answer because this happens in the fission reaction okay basically the binary fission reaction binary fission reaction and regenerate into new one the term regenerate here describe the regeneration okay so this also not the answer question uh, sorry option number 4 we have sexually reproduced so it is not the answer because it is a, a sexual reproduction okay so we have our answer the option number 2 simply breaks into smaller pieces upon maturation so this what happens in the fragmentation okay so spirogyra is the example of the fragmentation so just remember all those example of different type of sexual reproduction because the exam examiner might trick you okay now we have question number 6 so in the question number 6 which of these process the broken part grow so you have to tell in which process the broken part will grow okay so you have the question option number 1 fission fragmentation regeneration and budding so we know that in the fission reaction that uh, the parent cell is dividing okay into two daughter cells or the many daughter cells okay and in the fragmentation we have recently seen that the uh, uh, small pieces uh sorry a small piece on the maturation stage the body uh, the organs will divide it into small pieces okay so this not be the answer also and in the budding what will happen the bud grows as an outgrowth in a specific area and then it will detach after it uh, after its maturation okay so this is also not the answer so the answer will be regeneration in the regeneration what will happen like the example is plan area okay so if this is a plan area and some accident is happened and it its body part is divided into this type three parts okay so what will happen that this part will grow into a new part okay and this part also grow into a new part so here the parts are growing from the bro broken part okay so this is called the regeneration next we have which of the following is not correct in sexual reproduction okay so you have to tell which of the following is not correct not correct okay number option you have one option you have diversity in sexual reproduction so it is true because in this sexual reproduction we have the diversity okay because of the variation and this is the limitations also in the also in the sexual reproduction that there have the in the sexual reproduction there have the lack of diversity lack of diversity okay option number 2 you have variation is not in sexual reproduction variation is not in sexual reproduction so it is not true because the diversity is here and variation is not here so it is not true okay diversity is it is because of the variation it is a complex process yes it is a complex process than the uh, sexual reproduction zygote is forming in this process okay yes the zygote is forming in this process so the answer is which is not correct in sexual reproduction the answer is option number 2 variation is in the sexual reproduction okay option number 8 you have a bud sorry question number 8 you have a bud develop as an outgrowth in which process okay so you have option number 1 vegetative propagation budding fragmentation regeneration so this is simple the answer is the budding and what is the vegetative propagation in this asexual reproduction the seeds are not using okay for the plant growth and it is done by the vegetative parts of the plant and what is the vegetative part the stems leaves roots okay so there is a method like the cutting layering and the grafting okay and what is the cutting method in this method the stem is cut and then it will grow into a new plant layering also the stem 
the plant of this uh, the stem of this plant will grow into a soil and it becomes a plant again so we will cut this stem okay and what is the grafting we take two stems of different plants and just grind them and after some time we have seen that it is a it is a full fledged grown plant we have okay so these are some multiple choice questions we have now the time is over so we will take all the remaining questions in our next video okay so let's end this class here and we will meet in our next class thank you thank you for joining the class thank you again